Uh, Como estas, mi amigos? Uh, welcome to the Rip City Cards. Um, gonna do a little bit of Star Wars for the uh, insane PJC. See what we've got. I mean, it was 75 when I got in the car to uh, come to work today. Seventy-five. I will keep. Uh, well, I keep all the good stuff off off to the side anyway. So I'll I will have it available for you. Come on. <laughs> Isn't that... I thought uh, zero degrees Kelvin was like... Was like negative, uh, negative four. Weather thing, weather thing does not want to say. Interesting. Did the weather thing chat or did my chat? Did the weather thing break or did my chat break? Oh, no space. There you go. Okay, I was like, what the hell? Twenty-six degrees. Come on. Now. I went to Publix uh, last night to buy stuff to make chili because it was going to be so cold. And I did that in shorts and uh, shorts and flip flops. Jumping out fancy. Fancy and low numbered right out of the gate. Numbered 10 out of 10. A galactic medallion for a flame trooper. 10 out of 10. Huh. I've never seen one that low. I've seen them like 99s and you know, stuff like that, but never... Uh, Never that low. Let me go and make some room because this is going to get messy in a hurry. Only thing he said there were like platinum ones that are one of ones, but I honestly don't know what they look like to even be able to say like, oh, that looks like a platinum one. -on -one.
Yeah, say Orlando. That's about. Uh, I, I mean, I, I'm we're doing. Uh, Almost 70. All right, more. Well, it's numbered. That's just that's just where I live. I mean, 32 out of 99. Stormtrooper costume. This is the lower left leg of said said stormtrooper. Yeah, how's your how's your Spanish, Lee? How is your Spanish? Okay, Daisy, how's it going? Yeah, it's weird. Like, my mom lives, <clears throat> like, let's just say Lakeland area, Agent Smith, but, like, there's more Mexican individuals there than there are, like, Puerto Ricans because of First Order Transporter Gold. Like, it's also kind of close to Plant City and, like, some of the groves and stuff. Like, so there's a lot of people doing, uh... What the F you call it? Taking over the things. The <clears throat> picking fruit. Good lord, I'm starting to worry a little, just a little bit about the, uh, about the old brain. Something particularly bad happen, or just general, uh, like you're trying to sell it and nobody wants it kind of deal? You never have too much of something. Well, if let's see, if you're still leaning towards the baseball tribute uh, special edition, got some of that today. That's kind of interesting. I'd never seen it before, to be honest. Yeah, Paul, I think is was just gonna go through and finish them. He's been picking on him for a few days. Or a couple of weeks, I guess. There might be, like, an old one, if you wanted Star Wars, like... Oh, wait. Gelf cleaned. Of course Gelf cleaned. I don't know. We had a loose box for a little while, but I don't know where that is now. He did.
let's see, there are three breaks in the store. It is my uh, obligation to tell you about such things. The Bowman 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 is a one super jumbo, one jumbo, one hobby. That is divided into 15 spots, with each spot getting you two random teams. There is a, what did I call it? A uh, walk off bunt, I believe. That is a four box, no, three box, no, four, yeah, it is four box. Four box baseball mixer. It is a box or pack, whatever you want to call it, of this. Uh, tribute stuff. It's two autos, two patches per deal. Two boxes of Strata, which is one patch, or at least it's one patch, one auto per box. And also a box of Bowman's Best, which is four autos. And that as well divided into 15 spots, two random teams per spot. Then there is a four-point slam dunk and one basketball break. Two boxes of Court Kings, two boxes of T-Cert. This, as well as many others, again, divided into 15 spots. Two teams per spot. All breaks under $40. I believe the basketball is under 30 already on top the galactic medallion of the resistance x-wing squadron for array let's see I need to take it out of the store because I do not have any more uh, national treasures that I have completely finished off um, at least my portion of it for now. Um, still do have the Immaculate uh, Multisport. That stuff is uh, fairly nice. I have a break of that in the store. Conference business. Three boxes of what? Of national treasures, yeah, yeah. And then Archie went through a case. Um, Archie's case did, but the three boxes, no. Archie had a one-of-one uh, one Kirby Puckett uh, cut book, cut auto. Um, Lee, I mean, if you want national, if you desperately want national treasures, you can go go to uh, Bateson's site. I think he has like. Uh, like ten, like ten breaks of it uh, listed right now. Yeah, you got Akbar, Admiral Akbar. Yeah, I didn't, I mean, I only remember it happening, not a whole lot about it, like him and uh, Tony Gwynn.
The book is nice. And Puckett, I think, is my second favorite player of all time. Favorite baseball player. Wait, the uh, the Star Wars or the Pocket? This is a Admiral Akbar Tim Rose. Paul's not going to be super happy with it. Yeah, I have a uh, a loose date to go and see the Star Wars movie on Sunday. If it's even still playing. It's, it's probably not even playing. Which would be about my level of Level of luck right about right about now. But I will be taking uh, Sunday off. Cause screw it, why not? Free um, stuff Friday tomorrow. I don't know what to, what I'm gonna be giving away. I got I found two boxes of stuff that are open, but I don't know what's in them. There's nothing like really awesome coming out of this. All right, Hootay, thank you for uh, getting into the tribute, man. Uh, that it will go out uh, in the mail tomorrow for you, so you should get an email uh, confirmation or like not a confirmation, but an email tracking number from PayPal. If you don't, I can get it for you. Again, swing by tomorrow, maybe if you've got time. It's a uh, free stuff Friday. I will be giving shit away all night long. And and I will ha I will uh, have the green screen up too. So there it's going to be it's going to be pure entertainment. Oh, so pure. Mm, we have a sketch card. Sketch card from this dude. No idea who the artist is. Could not be bothered to uh, sign a name of any of any of any goodness. I don't know. I guess it's the dude. I, I don't even know what his name is because I haven't seen the movie. 
to know what uh, what the black guy's name is. I'm guessing that that's who. Uh, but it does very much look like Mike Tyson. Or you are racist and you think all black people look alike. One of the two. I can't say. I can't say. Oh, it's a snow trooper, and it's a, a medallion. You know, with the price of copper these days, that uh, that could be a, a pretty penny just uh, to scrap. Star Wars, you are a war in space. I can't believe all the time that I spent putting those those uh, mixers together in the store, and no one except Lee has any interest at all. <coughs> it's almost soul crushing. If I had a soul, it would be, it would probably be upset. But, as I don't have a soul, it's uh, not as upsetting. More, I guess, disconcerting is the word. I did watch a movie on the uh, on the HBO last night Lee <laughs> if I sold my soul do you think that I am gonna be here opening Star Wars cards in a closet in Miami at 9:30 at night just think about that for for a second The answer is no. That or I got the worst deal ever. I got completely bamboozled on a, uh, a soul break. I got like tenth pick in a uh, in a draft and ended up with ended up with this. They could be worse. I'm not bitching as much as just whining. I mean, it is 70 degrees here. Temperature is lovely. It's uh, it's walk on the beach, you know, with just a with a little a little chill, perhaps. Uh, e Dirks, he bought into two breaks on Wednesday. But I have not seen him. Like I tweeted out that two were getting uh, low. I think he saw that I had tweeted that to business, and then uh, and got some spots to help fill some stuff. But he hasn't been in. I know he's been uh, been on Bateson's channel, but has not uh, has not come by here. I'll give you his address if you want to go by and see if he's uh, you know, if he's all right or anything. I did get to play a few hours of Fallout uh, yesterday, and I'm a little bit torn. I can't decide if I want the dog as basically my 
long-term companion or if I want somebody that actually has like a gun or something. No, I know for sure he's been, he's been in Bateson's room. Because I, I mean, I've heard, you know, been over here and heard him. Good evening, either. So, maybe he just doesn't like me anymore. I don't know. What? Okay, so Bateson says that E. Dirks texted him that he does not want to have anything to do with the Rip City. That uh, I am an asshole. See, that was uh, that was a very serious consideration, Agent Smith, because I got um, like right before I went to, uh, and that's not even true, like about E. Dirks. No, I'm just I'm completely joking about that. On my way to Diamond City, I got some uh, some super mutant companion. I forget what his name is even now. And he is like all up in people's faces. I mean, he at least does take like the the pressure off when you know I'm in the middle of stuff. Strong, strong, yes. But at the same time, he was like very unhappy with a lot of things that I uh, that I did, like asking please and stuff. Like he uh, he seemed a little pissed. Uh, with some of that or do I take the uh, take the perk go no companion and get like the 15% bonus well see that's the other thing uh, the the Valentine guy he can hack terminals even like expert terminals that is I mean there's like handiness all abound with these people so yeah it's a difficult it's a difficult choice I mean I finished Fallout 3 with the super mutant as like as ba as my companion sadly I don't even remember his name but I loved his uh, his minigun. I mean, I'm literally only like ten hours into it, so I mean, I, I barely even touched the surface of it. I've just been busy. And oddly enough, that ten hours is me playing twice. <laughs> that's that's like that's what Fallout does to you. I've played the game twice, and it has totaled over 10 hours of uh, gameplay. <laughs> like, there's about a 95% chance like I would play tonight. It is, uh, I, at least so far, like hella harder than Fallout 3 or New Vegas was. At least, I, at least I die a lot more. I guess it doesn't necessarily mean that it's harder. I'm just shittier at it, one of the two. But I still love it. Something about being in that wasteland just uh, makes me feel good. All right, it's numbered. 123 out of 179. Silver medallion for Ray Ray. Jump straight into a 61 out of 99 Stormtrooper action for upper arm piece. Mm. 
And I feel kind of bad, like, like when the dog gets hurt and is like whimpering and stuff. Like I want to heal him, but at the same time, I do not want to spend a uh, stim pack on his ass. Because I know he's gonna get better anyway, but it still makes still uh, feel weird about it. I do like the addition of the cyborgs or the you know cybernetic people, whatever from the institute. That's uh, interesting to me. I've currently made the decision to see if I can go far enough to get uh, my own power armor from the Brotherhood. Or if that's uh, too difficult a task. What's up, 1987 Twins? 1991. Dude, do you want to have your uh, do you want to have your mind blown? Well, I know it is. I mean, I I lived in it in you know Fallout Three. I just know I, I know they tweaked it a little bit because you got to have like a fusion core to get it now or to like make it work. Um, well, let me show you something fancy, eighty seven twins. Pull this out of uh, National Treasures today. Kirby Cut Patch Auto. I knew you would. Uh, I knew you would appreciate it. And if that wasn't enough, one on one. No, uh, actually, K. Dacey gave me uh, gave me twenty five for it. I was like, I'm only asking twenty, and he's like, No, 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 I'll give you twenty five for it. And I said, All right, who am I to argue? I made out like a bandit on that because it's it's not even like Kirby Puckett autographed it. You know, I mean, they had to take it. They cut it off of something that they found probably in the trash that he had signed. I mean, I really. Almost feel bad for screwing K Dacey over on that one, but twenty five dollars is twenty five dollars. No, that it will be on eBay uh, before too long, because every well, not everything, but most of the stuff that Archie opens goes to a guy that does you know eBay sales of it. So wait, what am I doing? I didn't even finish opening the packs and I'm. All out of all out of them, all confused. You don't happen to uh, play Fallout uh, 4, do you? Uh, 1987 Twins, 1991. Trying to alienate uh, everybody by babbling on about my plans for about the next 20-ish hours worth of uh, play of that. Yeah, I mean, if he, if he didn't, if he wasn't going to ask, like, some foolish amount of money for it, like, I would, I would love to have that. <laughs> oh yeah, this is gonna this will be this is gonna get interesting uh 
interesting big time then. Have you beat it yet, Agent Smith? All right, we got some uh, snow trooperage. 60 out of 199. Yeah, I tend to do that myself, like when I play. Like, I will have cleared, you know, 90% of, of the buildings and, like, the like relatively like available areas and stuff before I'll like push you know push through to the end of it I mean it's like I said I just have not had time to get into it like I would have liked to Ooh, a gold Chewbacca that's probably uh, probably fairly solid only one in every box The only thing I did read, like, hey, it's a plate, a first order flame trooper, black printing plate, and everybody knows that uh, there is, uh, that black is the best. Thirty-five quart. All right. I will try and remember that. Hey, weird, man. Back-to-back -back plates? Flight of the X-Wing? I wonder if they got stuck together. Because I find it highly unlikely that they decided to throw two plates in uh, one, one package. Yeah, I just, man, I don't know. I almost just want to live, I mean, I want to live in, in, in the little city, like where my home is, like, you know, build it up, make it a, you know, make it a super awesome place, but there's just so much shit to look at and do and people to kill and things to find. It's almost overwhelming. Almost overwhelming. But it's not. Wait, didn't I pull a gold out of this already? Or have I lost? Am I losing my damn mind? Pose mission? I'm about to check. I'm about to check this mess because I might. I might be. I might be losing my gourd. Yeah, I'm trying to think. I feel like I was pretty lucky. Like. Mate, I mean, that's one, two, three, four, five, six golds. So maybe not. There was only seven. I don't. I've. I don't know. I seriously don't know.
I mean, I have basically, uh... I had it before this job a little bit. A little, I mean, a little bit. Now, I just, now I don't know. Just open packs, close packs. I would I would take a brain. I would be willing to undergo a, a brain transplant. Although I'm pretty sure that whoever's brain I got when they like woke up and were like, "Oh my god, I'm not dead. I'm in a new body." And then look at my body would be like, "Oh shit, man. Maybe this wasn't such a good idea." What's up, best breaks? Damn, somebody. Jax has pissed off somebody. My goodness. Because that's not the first guy. Like, actually, somebody came in... Uh, earlier today, like, I don't know who it was, but I am me saying, like, listen, uh, there's, like, been people going around, like, spamming, you know, Jackson breaks or whatever, it seems like there's no Jackson, but whatever, let's just call them Jacks for now, Jacks breaks, and, like, they don't, you know, support them or whatever, like, they're just, they're trying to get Jacks in trouble, and please feel free to ban You know, ban or report whoever, you know, whoever does it in your room. Yeah, it's just none of it's mine. That's the, I mean, that's the only thing that sucks. I get to see all the fancy cards, but none of it's mine. What's up, Kay Gitch? How you doing? I think it was, uh, Agent Smith. I think it was. Well, yeah, because even, uh, I mean, I don't know if they want to say, I want to say who it was, but somebody went into, into their room and was like, listen, somebody's doing this, and they told them, you know, ban them or port them, you know, because it's, you know, they're not, uh, nobody that's, I mean, that's in a breaker's room is going to be like, oh, shit, somebody else is, is doing something awesome? Uh, let's, uh, you know, let's go over there. Well, it is unnumbered, but it's a galactic medallion for the Han Solo. Yeah, I still have not, uh, still have not uh, banned anybody because you because Bergy did get to it uh, before me. But really, reporting is the way you have to go. Because, I mean, you can make a thousand accounts, but once they start, like, banning your ass, eh, I don't, I don't, I don't have the, uh, my stolen cookies anger in me like I did last time. I mean, that was really just the cookies talking, that, uh, that bandage. What if it's all a, uh, what if it's a complete bamboozler? Think about this. 
what if Jax breaks is sending them into rooms then telling then going around telling people hey somebody's you know pissed with us to try and get them to try and get you to uh, feel bad for them and then maybe to go uh, you know check them out and or something could be could be complete bamboozlement level 7 bullshittery even I'm, this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to go in as Rip City cards to everybody's room and be like, hey, awesome stuff going on here, guys. Uh, don't, uh, you know, don't buy from these losers. Buy from me. Oh, Warwick Davis. Double bamboozled on the auto action. But Paul, he is not going to be happy with this. Did I tell Mario about the guy? Because it's not, he's actually not the VP of Miami operations. He's the uh, international operations manager for Ripping Wax. So I was gonna buy him a. Oh yeah, no. I mean, he I te he was the first one I texted. I was like, do you know who did this? And he uh, did not. But Bates claims to uh, have no, you know, he claims that when he saw that it was open, that it then became, you know, a field day upon said cookies, but that he was not the one to open the actual package. And then I explain as if, if I had... Uh, that I would have murdered people if it had been Samoas. And uh, the Gelfman agreed with me. I guess before he went all uh, all gluten-free, he was a Samoa fan as well. Well, no, I mean, the... Ay, 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 easy there. Easy there, sister. There's Mario. There's Alyssa. There's Darren. Jesse is new. Ciara is new. Bates. Gelf. Shakes. We got like we got like nine people up in here with including uh, including me. We're high damn profile. Well, I mean, between Bates and uh, Kazu, that barely keeps keeps things going. <laughs> 